house boy 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 in the house and I'm in the house boy 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 in the hello rattlers this is Dr. Rayford well at least the cartoon version of Dr. Rayford I know one of the favorite times of the day for a lot of you is after school this morning I am going to be listing all of the opportunities that you have to choose from from after school as you're watching the video, make sure you're thinking about which of these activities you'd like to select. When the video is done, your teacher is going to meet with you and allow you to pick the opportunity that you want to participate in. First up, we have our Rattler baseball team. Although we're not participating in any fall sports, we hope to have our Rattler baseball team joining the Little League for the first time this spring. So our Rattler baseball team will be playing against several other teams and Little League Baseball. Under the direction of Coach Williams, with the collaboration I hear from Coach Lopez, I'm sure our Rattler baseball team is going to be unstoppable. Next up, we have Rattler Basketball. Our Rattler Basketball team traveled all over the city, giving those other teams a run for their money. With Coach Overstreet returning for his second year as the basketball coach and the addition of our seventh graders, I am sure our Rattlers are going to dominate this season. With the support of our fan base and the skills of our scholars, it is definitely going to be magic. If you have basketball, you know you have to have cheerleaders. Our cheerleaders travel all over the city with our teams. They cheer for basketball games, football games, participate in parades. Our cheerleaders keep the spirit and hype our Rattlers up as they compete against the different schools all around the city. Under the direction of Miss Shaquille Jackson, our cheerleaders are always ready to hype the house up. If you have baseball, basketball, and cheerleading, you know we gotta have some football. What's poppin'? Brand new whip, just hopped in. I got options. I can pass that stats like Stockton. Just joshing. I'm spending this holiday locked in. My body got rid of them toxins. Sports in the top 10. With our competitive team under the direction of Coach Kirkland for a second year and our football club under the direction of Coach Curry, it is definitely going to be an amazing year. Our football team will crisscross the city, playing against different parks and recreation centers, boys and girls clubs, and schools. Since these next two organizations always perform together, I'm going to go ahead and introduce them together. We have Majorette and Drumline. have performed in many events. They performed in Jamboree, they participated in the Tampa Martin Luther King Parade, they went to the Florida Classic in Orlando, Florida. They performed at the Strawberry Festival Parade in Plant City, and for Bethune-Cookman University's Homecoming Parade in Daytona Beach. Under the direction of Mr. Grooms, the Marching Rattlers will be on the road again this year as they travel to Birmingham, Alabama, The Magic City Classic is one of the largest HBCU football games in the nation. This game is going to bring together marching bands from all over the country. Let's Drumline and Majorette will also be performing in New Orleans, Louisiana for Mardi Gras. Go, 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 go. Who's next? Who's next? 
Last, but certainly not least, we have our technology club. We have technology for both boys and girls. So if you're interested in technology during that time, you'll get to play video games, work on schoolwork, listen to music, and participate in coding with computer mentors. So you have many options to choose from. Get with your teacher and they're gonna help you make that decision now.